What's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Alvy Skinny. Number five, nigga. And today, we are here to check out Pet Cemetery. This is the second trailer. Uh, we haven't checked out the first, honestly. We're just seeing this randomly popping up in the trending. And I know it's by Stephen King and John Lithgow. So, yeah, man. Uh, let, I, well, before we get into it, I heard this was a <clears throat> book. At first, it was a great book. Cinco, uh, <coughs> you, you, you haven't read the book? I don't read. Yeah, okay, great point. Great Everybody point. can tell I don't be reading no damn book. What kind of question is that to be asking your nigga that? Come on, now, you know me better than that. Uh, yeah, all right. But yeah, uh, great point. Um, I know who he is, though. I haven't read the book either myself, you know. I do read about six books a week but this was not one of them that i happen to read so yeah let's get into this video oh this is the same thing that could hit too that's crazy and we discovered a charming so little landmark movie, right. the pet cemetery place to bury our pets and remember them. Which seems scary, but it's not. Nigga, pause that shit. Perfectly. Nigga, did you see how many damn pets? That's what I was about to say. Alright, first off, if I'm, if, I'm, if I'm any age and I'm walking in that motherfucker and I see damn near more than two pets dead, <laughs> I see 50 pets dead. All in the same spot. In the same spot, organized, nigga. Like, I'm just placing these pets easily. Like, somebody is easily just placing each pet. 50... Pets just down easily. No remorse, nothing. <laughs> Nigga, hell no. I'm gonna keep running past all 50 of them motherfuckers and go straight through the woods and forget where the house I came from. And that's it. Movie over. For, for, for <laughs> real, though. For real, nigga, move. For real, though, because damn. But you know what I'm saying? We still going. Yeah, we a movie, though. We in the movie. movie. Yeah, fast guy. See what natural. Just like dying is natural. The whole town's been using this place for generations. No, 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 Folks make a no. kind of ritual out of it. It's not some campfire story. I saw these little trees up there. They're warnings. The local tribes carved them before they fled. They fear that place. There's something up there. Something that dates way back. Those woods belong to something else. Something. That cat was dead. It brings things back. Cheers. Oh, cheers. Oh, shit. I know what you're thinking of doing. <laughs> but they don't come back the same. What's going on? Fuck your daughter. I should never have shown you that place. Your child is not the only thing that will come back. The barrier is broken. shit like nigga my eyes bobbled out my shit like dude how would you feel for one that your daughter died then you try to bring her back you get her to come back but your daughter possessed now you want to kill her like but you can't kill her but this is your daughter you love her so much yeah but she want to kill you but my thing is i haven't actually Checked out the the pet pet um cemetery books, but I think I think the basis of it is you know what I'm saying the pets die and then they put the pets either their face or their their shit into someone a human that they probably killed and put them together. I don't know. 
And that's why the girl now, she died, so they try to recreate her like the, they try to re- recreate the animals. But my thing, yeah, I was about to say, where does the intertwine of the pets and the people come into play? Putting them together in there. The, so then probably, the, probably the brain from uh, the living animal becomes the, 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 the person. Yeah. And then the living animal probably is the person. And then you got to figure out a way to switch the both back. No, no, the animals. That'd be a good movie, though. Yeah, that would. But the animals, no, they just get killed. For sure. No, that animal was still there. It was still... The cat? Yeah. It's Maui. But, damn. Honestly, this was a great trailer. Like, it... Yeah, dude, this shit crazy. This shit really got me into it. Somebody talk about it. You trying to hit that? I watched somebody talk about it. My ears are funny. (laughs) (laughs) Yeah, the... Uh, let me run this back a little bit. We have a second chance. Oh. Sometimes dead is bad. You see her back? <laughs> oh my gosh. You remember when, uh, damn, uh, on Family I Parents, I think it was Chester, and his hamster got brought back, and that motherfucker looked all fucked up. Or no, it was Timmy's hamster or something. Regardless, is the point of the shit I'm getting is, once they dead, my nigga, do not try to bring them back. It's the reason they dead. And like, that, that's the thing with whole life in general. You like, don't fuck with the, the dead. The man up above did it for a reason. If you die, like, it is what it is. Like, if I die right now, it is what it is. Can't, I can't be in here sitting like, oh, uh, let me go get Amari back. I got to put him back. Get me back. I might motherfucking be like that. I mm-hmm. might end up being crazy mm-hmm. and say I'm trying to kill this nigga. <laughs> yeah, like, what the fuck? You niggas is fucking around, Like, man. nigga, you just took me out of the damn ground. I was in heaven and you just took me out this shit. Nah, I'm back. Oh, I'd be mad at nigga. Look, I'm a, I just, that's a point right there. Nigga, you, if I die and I do go up above and you motherfucking bring me back. Yeah, you bring me back and say, well, no. you and then it's having a good time. And then all of a sudden you just Whoa. sit there and just, look, nigga, you back in this shit. You like, oh, and you ugly as damn. hell too. You not even looking the same. <laughs> and your nigga just right there. Yo, bro, bro you, you back. back. I'm going to be back. like, I'm going to really be a demon. I'm sorry. I'm, gonna, I'm about to go to yes, hell. I think yeah. I know it. I'm not even going to go back to heaven. Oh, you fucking. Bitch, I'm so much like nigga. Come on now, I feel it. No, Look, you know I see why. It's kind of crazy. Yeah, like, I gotta put myself in the perspective. I'm a scary nigga. Now nah, I'm not even scared. Like nigga, that's what I'm gonna start doing in movies. I'm gonna just take a pause in the and movie just realize. and just realize what they had to go through. They'd be like, well, shit. If I went through that, what would I do? And I would be like, I, like if I'd I was be pretty like, mad if I'd I was be, that person. I wouldn't be like no, going on no crazy stage. I just, you feel me? I'd be. I understand why they be because that's they, that's they, that's what they do. Me, I'm gonna just smoke a blunt and cool. It. Yeah, facts. They can, they don't smoke, so you feel I me? Mean? That's what happens when you don't have no THC in your system. You get to tripping. You did to doing shit. Yeah, you get some shit like that in your back or something. I don't know. Shit's crazy. Sometimes dead is better. Really feel like, That's why I don't even fuck with cats. Yeah, me. Either. I never yeah. fuck with a cat. Honestly, I, I really like cats. I, 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 but I, I like them, but I hate them at the same time because they're so, they look so fluffy. They look like it's just like ah. they just look but, snaky. Yeah, but at the same time, they will snake the fuck Nigga, out of I me. Man, 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 whenever I see a cat, bro, I go the other way, bro. Like I don't even like. I'd rather see a, a cat. I'd rather see a dog run after me than a damn cat. Cause nigga, the cat gonna jump. Farther than that. Like, it's just the gonna, fangs on you? Yeah, it's going to stick to me. I mean, not the fangs, the uh, claws. Yeah, it's going to have the claws, his mouth. Like, nigga, uh, the dog's just going to have his mouth on me trying to... Yeah, yeah, you you, you can push and evade uh, that. Yeah, I can't really... I got to slap that bitch, you feel me? Like, I got to move, like, push that... I can't even push that bitch. You push it one way, it got another... Whoosh, grab onto your hand. If I push it, it's going to bite my hand. Mm. Like, nigga, that shit going to hurt. 
Then, then I don't even want to touch it. And then I'm like, dude, I can't even move, dude. Get the fucking shit. Get shoot that up. shit. Shoot that shit, dude. Fuck that. You then get I, shot then I, then I, on you. Yeah, then I'm getting shot. Then the cat live. Now, now the cat got my body. You feel me? Like then I'm then then I'm in the pet cemetery. Then we just make movies, sitting here talking. Hey, y'all nigga. Hey, Paramount. Hey, st- <clears throat> y'all nigga. Yeah, we got ideas for days, nigga. No cow. For real. No cow. Fuck with us, man. <laughs> hey, m- nigga, this shit crazy. This, this nigga movie is crazy. You gotta yeah. be thinking crazy shit. Yeah, definitely. Honestly, that w- we got to see this one, man. For real. Pet cemetery. Paramount nah, pictures. I don't know about that. I be keeping on. So I don't be. I'm scared. <laughs> I can't be going to shit like that. You feel me? I go back home and look at everything. You know, look at look at all your damn the animals right, different. Nigga. If an animal die, you feel me? I'm not going. To, I'm not going to treat it the same. <laughs> That's what I say. Like no, nigga. don't don't be sad hey, nigga, for that where, nigga. Where you burying that nigga? nigga? Yeah, where you burying? It's your house. <laughs> oh hell, no, I ain't going there. <laughs> For real, I'm about to walk down your studs, get stabbed in the leg with a, with a girl with a little mask on. Oh, that shit got me thinking crazy now, yeah, dude. I know some people that didn't bury their people. So it's all right, nigga. Yeah, me too. And I, I done walked up some steps and seen like a cat at the front too, just like mm, just looking all nice. And she's like, "Hey, kitty." And I just imagine if I walk up and just boom, get stabbed in my Achilles. Like, wow. More of the story. I really don't feel like we should trust cats, guys. Uh, yeah, just get you a dog. Yeah. I mean, if they die, you feel me? At least you feel good that your dog... Because dogs don't die until you feel... You You, you gonna know your dog gonna die. And I didn't see too much of dogs doing nothing crazy in this movie, I don't think. There wasn't no dog in this damn movie. Yeah. The straight cats. Straight fucking pussies. That's it, so... So, yeah, man. Shout out to Pet Cemetery, Paramount. Make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, all that. Till next time, YouTube.